North Carolina A&T football and KFC have something in common, and that is the mantra, we do chicken. In the first two games of the season against Furman, as well as it against Duke on the road, the Aggies did not do chicken or did not do chicken well. But against North Carolina Central, their rival this past Saturday, I guess you could say the Aggies finally did chicken right. By the attitude coming up a win, of course it's a good, uh, sweet feeling, you know, to win a ball game. Uh, we needed it uh, very desperately. And uh, I'm very pleased with the overall play of the team. Um, but I think it's very important that we don't get too high. Um, uh, that was last week. Uh, it's all about the preparation for this week. Uh, this is the first game in the Big South, and uh, it's, it's very important to us. Did your team play as dominantly as you thought they could against North Carolina Central? No. I think, I think we, we could have played much better, honestly. Um, we, uh, we play well, uh, but it's not consistently. And that's, that's a, a big concern of mine. I think the intensity, it fluctuates too much. You know, we up there really high, and then next thing you know, uh, we, we hit a low and not nearly as focused or uh, as good. From what you've seen so far, Robert Morris, uh, what's gonna be the key? I know chicken is always the key. Mm -hmm. Anything in particular that stands out in terms of facing this team? You know, uh, offensively, we got to, um, our eyes must be good. You know, jumping in and out of those different fronts, that changes the calls and the audibles. And um, the offensive line gonna have to be um, very good at what they do. And Jalen gonna have to be very good at what he does. Any special message, being that this is the first, uh, any special message you will emphasize this week, being that this is the first game in the new conference? Mm, that's a good one. Mm -hmm. uh, don't forget to go. You know, and, and to reach our goal, we got to win the first one.